Hey guys, it's Mook and Android here. So you've rooted your phone and you want to spice it up a bit now. You wanna you wanna play with it, but um, we don't have access to custom ROMs as of just yet. True custom ROMs. So uh, what we're gonna do instead is start theming our phone, um, which is what I've been doing. I've actually already made a video. Uh, my last one, I believe, was the bl uh, Blue Mist theme. That one was pretty cool, but I've actually recently changed it again because it just didn't suit my taste. But um, I have found one, um, another one. Um, which is Honey Glow Honeycomb Theme version 3.2 and uh, so I scrolled through it and um, liked it and decided I'd uh, make a little video and show you guys how to theme your phone. So first step you're gonna want to, um, well what I did anyways was uh, went on over to XDA forums if you're not already signed up I uh, do recommend doing so. Um, they actually have a uh, themes and apps section uh, for the Motorola Atrix, and um, they've got all kinds of really cool themes um, from some people that worked really hard um, to to bring us some eye candy for our phones. Um, anyways, I found this one, and um, the my preferred method of installation um, is uh, using Clockwork uh, Mod. Um, so, anyways, so. What you do here is you go down and you locate their um, the Clockwork Mod uh, update. So version 3.2, um, I download that. And also, you're going to want to download um, the Launcher Pro dock icons. And that you will use after you flash version 3.2, uh, which is the actual theme. So, once you've downloaded both, um, you're going to go on over to the place that, uh, the folder you have it downloaded to, and I happen to have them right here, and the first one you're going to, well, you, you could um, drop both of them onto the root of your SD card, um, but you're only going to be using Clockwork uh, Recovery Mod for Honeyglow. Um, the Launcher Pro that you're going to be installing after, um, you will be using like you know like you're a file manager of some sort, you know Astro or whatever you whatever you use, whatever you prefer. Um, you're going to be using um, that to to extract this and flash it inside the phone itself. Um, anyways, moving along. <clears throat> so once you have it uh, downloaded um, and uh, you you have it on the root of your SD card. Um, you're going to go to your phone and uh, you are now going to plug it into your AC. So I have mine plugged into my AC and um, and uh, I'm just going to flip through this quickly because I'm actually going to be making a video of this theme, um, which I really like, but we'll get to that after. Um, anyways, so you're going to go to your app drawer and you are going to, and if you do have your phone rooted and you have a clock work uh, mod, um, you're going to go to system recovery. Boop. And again, making sure that you have your AC cord plugged in, uh, you're going to go ahead and hit recovery mode. And what this is going to do is boot us into recovery mode or clockwork mod. And um, that's where we'll be able to uh, flash the, um, the theme. So we'll just give this a minute here. Boop, 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 and you're going to be using the uh, power button on the back to press enter. So, I'm trying to do this with my left hand here. Um, you're going to go ahead and go down to install zip from SD card. Enter on that. Then you're going to go ahead and go down to uh, choose zip from SD card. Boop. Then you're going to go ahead and find Honeyglow version 3.2. And you're going to go ahead and select that. Boop. Then you're going to go down and select yes. Install Honey Glow version 3.2 update. Now I'm not going to do that because I already have, and I don't want to erase any of the um, 
settings I already have on it. But um, once you select that, uh, it's going to install, and you're going to see a bunch of crap flash and do all kinds of neat stuff, and then it'll take seconds, and then uh, you'll get at the bottom a little bar saying um, installing, and then boom, it'll say install complete. Once that's done, there's one more step you have to do while you're in here. You're going to want to go down to go back, and then go back again, all the way to the main menu here. This is the important part. Um, go down to advanced and go to wipe Dalvik cache. Okay, um, I'm not really sure why that's important, but they say it's very important in order to get like a nice clean, um, a nice clean flash of the theme there. Um, once you do that, then you're going to go go back, and then you're going to reboot system now. And once you reboot the system, you'll get to see what the new um, boot animation is. So we'll just wait for that to happen. I'll probably cut this out so you guys don't have to wait. There it is. So it's kind of a neat boot animation that it comes with, um, which is kind of a bonus. But of course, like me, you will probably get bored and want to flash some other ones. <laughs> Alright, so... Um, now, keeping in mind, you do have, you still now need to flash the um, the Launcher Pro, the custom Launcher Pro. So, in order to do that, you're going to want to go and locate your um, your file uh, manager or whatever program you use. I use e Easy File S or what's this called? ES File S Explorer. I don't know. Anyways, um, I'm going to open that up, and uh, you're going to locate the file on your SD card and it'll be called Honey Glow. Okay? Now Honey Glow is the file that you're going to be getting after you extract um, the Launcher Pro uh, the custom Launcher Pro. Uh, so once you this isn't the SD card SD card where are we? Okay, this thing's got me lost. I'll have to use the other one. Alright, so, SD card. There's a Launcher Pro. You're going to click that. Boop! And extract contents of this file into current folder. You're going to click Yes. Uh, once it extracts, you will then find that Honey Glow um, folder with all of those... Um, um, the, the, the icons that you need. Um, you're going to want to take that folder and move it into like your internal uh, somewhere on your internal storage so that your gallery can, um, can read it, can pick it up. Because for some reason it wasn't picking it up before when um, I had it just installed on the SD card. Um, I don't know why. Um, I read a couple of people had the same problem. So you just, just move the Honey Glow file to um, to the root of your internal phone storage and everything should work out. Once you've done that, um, then you'll be able to go to gallery to double check and uh, it should be there um, like mine is. See that? All right. Once that's done, um, keeping in mind, and, and this is something that I missed <laughs> actually uh, before, before you extract the custom Launcher Pro, you must have Launcher Pro uninstalled. Your version of Launcher Pro must be uninstalled before you extract and flash the custom Launcher Pro, alright? Now, moving along, um, in order to get these icons up, all you gotta do is press and hold, boop, and that will pop up. And then, change icon, custom icon and you'll be able to pick which one you want and as you can tell they all have a bit of a blue tinge even those ones there those ones were my favorite because they're the most clean looking they look the best on a uh, white wallpaper background so anyways 
yeah, pretty sweet, and that's all it takes, and as a result, this is the um, result that you get, because if you don't flash the Custom Launcher Pro, um, a lot of these little icons will be white or gray, and it just won't work. Anyways, there you go, guys. Um, I hope you have luck in looking for your theme of choice. And of course, last but not least, please don't forget to rate, comment, or subscribe. And if you do need to get a hold of me, you can either message me here or reach me at the smoking android at gmail.com. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you next time.